Hello friends, Clayton Phillips here from Woody's RV World in Leduc, Alberta, Canada. And I'm just shooting a uh, quick little, little shot here of our, our brand new dealership here. I guess it's not quite brand new anymore. We've been here for a little over a year and a half. And I gotta tell you that we are just so absolutely blessed to be able to come to work every day and work in such a beautiful facility. There's a shot of our beautiful covered delivery area where all of our customers that take advantage of an RV here at our dealership here in Leduc, Alberta, Canada, uh, underneath our covered area where we set everything up and make sure that uh, the trailer's operating properly and just really take the time to show off and show you how to work your new RV. But um, what we're really focusing in on here today is a brand new arrival. Uh, this particular trailer just showed up from the factory a few hours ago. Uh, it hasn't even made it around back to our facility, so you're gonna see what this trailer looks like uh, as it made a 2,000 mile journey up to our dealership here in Leduc, Alberta. And this is where Grand Design really shines, folks. This is the all new Transcend Explore Edition. 261 BH. This is Grand Design's entry into the travel trailer segment. And again, Grand Design going the extra mile, taking the extra steps, really putting the build, the foundation, the structure, the added value uh, compared to a lot of other products out there. And uh, Grand Design has just hit the ball out of the park with this brand new arrival, the 261 BH. And this is actually a redo of a classic floor plan and Grand Design has done just a phenomenal job really uh, enhancing what the old floor plan was but keying in on just some of the really nice aspects of why the floor plan was successful so many years ago. So again, we're gonna jump into it. Again, the Transcend Grand Design, that's their entry into the, the towable segment, folks. And uh, the Explore just allows them to get that price down just a little bit more. So let's jump into the product starting right up front here on the Transcend Explore. Explore, they give the uh, quick drop tongue jack. This particular jack has a manual crank handle, uh, but also when it flips over, this nut here is exposed and you can actually put a drill right down over top of that and that will raise and lower the front end of your trailer really, really fast. Uh, comparatively to just using the manual crank on it. But again, Grand Design's way of getting the price down on the on the trailer. Again, 20 pound propane tanks, automatic switch over regulator, part of the exchange program, much easier to move around when they're full, all those sorts of things. And then you get the uh, tray up front uh, for your batteries. We always recommend dual six volt batteries. Uh, coming down the driver's side of the trailer here, they do give you the pre, uh, pre hookup for your uh, suitcase style solar panel that would plug right in there. But again, Grand Design true to form on their pass-through storage compartments, folks. 43 cubic feet of pass-through storage. You'll see that Grand Design, they radius the front end of the, the compartment here. They give you dual motion sensor lighting. A lot of manufacturers, folks, at this price point, they will not give you lights. Or if they give you a light, there's just one. Grand Design gives you two and their motion sensors. So you can close the compartment door and that light will automatically turn off really really slick but again true to form for grand design uh, at this price segment they're the only manufacturer using an enclosed utility compartment really cool thing when you have your uh, fresh water connection hooked up here you can fill up your fresh tank you just flip this lever here and that will automatically fill up your 62 gallon fresh water capacity that's right it's not a 30 gallon tank like a lot of other products in the industry in this price segment folks 62 gallons of fresh water capacity, which is fantastic. There's that porthole access so you can run your fresh water line up through and keep your compartment door locked and closed. Again, notice dual cam lock latches, not just two or one in some cases, like some manufacturers, and they give you the keyed lock with the magnet as well. So again, that's where they're going the extra mile on this particular product. Okay, um, we'll give you a shot here underneath the trailer as well. Again, fully enclosed. The tanks are heated on this particular product as well, folks. So, you know, heated, heated underbelly, forced air heat off your 30,000 BTU furnace. It's not a 20 or 25,000 uh, BTU, so they're really going the extra steps, which is nice. Low point drains with the valves attached. I encourage you to look up underneath the trailers and a lot of other products in the industry, folks, and you'll find that the um, the gate or the valve, the uh, low point drains, that hot uh, red and blue uh, hose there. 
um, that has a valve on it. A lot of manufacturers just use a cap, so a lot harder to uh, to get the water out of the lines. Grand Designs going the extra step again. So we'll just uh, jump back here as well. Really nice edgy design on this, very modern look. Grand Design uses the tough coat exterior paint on the Transcend Explore as well as the regular Transcend. So that textured paint finish is more, uh, more durable when it comes to the weathering of the trailer. The dirt and debris washes off a whole lot better, those types of things. And uh, just a thicker gauge aluminum uh, as compared to a lot of other manufacturers or brands out in the, uh, the segment as well. So. Um, again, Grand Design rack and pinion slide system on this as well. It's not a cable system. It's not a, um, you know, a system that um, with, with this particular model, if, you're, if your motor was to ever fail on you, there's literally just a drive nut pushed through the frame on the other side. Very easy. You put a crank handle on it and just manually crank in the slide. And again, Grand Design double blade seal, blade seal in here, blade seal here, and then your bulb seal. So when the slide out's retracted, if there's some moisture on it, it's gonna help squeegee off the, uh, the, the exterior of the slide out, which is really, really nice. Uh, one thing to note on the Transcend Explore folks, they don't put ladders on. That's purely for price point. That is not an indication other than just price point. With Grand Design, um, you have full walk-on roofs to be able to get up there and do some roof sealant touch-ups, uh, full stand-on slide boxes that Grand Design builds. Grand Design also, if you want the ladder on the back of this trailer, folks, you can add it. They put the bracing in the back wall to be able to add the ladder uh, at a later date if you so choose. Grand Design, again, a lot of manufacturers, folks, a lot of times if you don't see a ladder, that's a good indication that you do not have a walk-on roof. So just one th something to be aware of. Again, Grand Design, folks, when you're doing your shopping, these corner uh, edges and moldings, Grand Design, this uses their quad seal technology uh, that they use to seal in the exterior of their trailer. I can assure you there is no other manufacturer, folks, at this price point that does a seal on the exterior of their trailers like Grand Design. There is no butyl tape whatsoever on the exterior of this trailer. People go, well, Clayton, what's butyl tape? Butyl tape is a, is a sealant that has been used in the industry for decades. And the issue with butyl tape is that it dries out. It has a six month shelf life. And that particular product is famously used. If you look at the trailers and you see that sealant squeezing out around window openings or window frames, the corner moldings, all those sorts of things, um, that's the butyl tape and it literally will dry out. So a few years down the road, there's a good chance that you maybe will have some moisture intrusion. Grand Design uses the Mylar tape seal on the Explore and the Transcend. They use the uh, double PVC foam tape in behind a silicone cap seal here as well. So what's really nice about this, the PVC foam tape fills in around all of these little grooves and then the silicone cap seal goes over top. But what's really nice about the way that they've sealed this trailer is that if this cap seal silicone was to ever give way, what happens, the moisture can get in behind here and it's just a, a moisture uh, race wave to allow the moisture to drain out the bottom because that mylar tape seal goes over top of the rear wall and sidewall for example so I wanted to spend a little bit of time on that because that's one of the major differences that really separates Grand Design because when you're making a massive investment into it in, into your RV doesn't matter what Grand Design you're looking at right from the Transcend Explore up to a Momentum Solitude that can sell well over a hundred thousand dollars they're using that golden thread of consistency in terms of the seal and a lot of the other things that Grand Design does. So I know I've spent a lot of time on that, but um, felt like it was necessary. So pre-wire for your rear vision camera. You've got the spray port here for uh, spray water for an outdoor cook area if you wanted to set that up. You've got your uh, hot water heater here as well, Atwood style. So gas and electric on your hot water heater, six gallon, that gives you a 17.8 gallon quick recovery per hour which is really nice. You have the outdoor entertainment kitchen area uh, with storage, that's a drawer there. And then you've got the fridge here up underneath. You've got the barbecue quick connect here as well. So you can plug in your barbecue, you can plug in your portable fire pit if there's a fire ban on, 
all of those things, which is really, really nice. Again, Dexter towing system on all the Grand Design products. So five-year warranty on your axles, which is really nice. They use that Westlake Lion's Head tire, which gives you a five-year warranty, 12 months, no questions asked replacement. And then the Easy Lube hubs and never adjust brakes, nitrogen filled as well which is real nice. This one has the power awning as well. Really easy to adjust this power awning as well, folks. You just simply pull down here and that's gonna put the tilt to your roller tube so you can literally adjust what way you want the water to run off if it's starting to you know, rain a little bit. And you, you know, don't have to roll up your awning, those types of things. So again, we'll shoot in on the pass-through storage compartment here on this Transcend Explore 261BH. So we'll just flip this back up. As well as with Grand Design folks, <clears throat> industry leading, industry first manufacturer to offer the three year structural warranty, which you get on the Transcend Explorer as well. They're not holding back. Uh, doesn't matter what brand that they build, they're giving you that. So we're up inside the trailer, uh, which I'm real happy with what they've done with this. One of the things, the uh, additions, I mentioned earlier that this is an old school floor plan. Uh, the old school floor plan, all that slid out was the couch. Uh, but now Grand Design going the extra step, they're sliding out the refrigerator, the oven and range, the microwave. So you just get that much more floor space up on the inside of this trailer, which is really, really nice. Lots of counter space, as you can see. Lots of places to put your Keurig coffee maker and all the extra things that you're gonna, gonna use. Again, Grand Design going the extra mile. They're giving you the shelf in your storage compartments. Real nice lighter cabinetry in here to really help brighten up the interior. Really good modern look. Um, kitchen uh, sink is an under counter mount sink. So if you spill something here, you just simply wipe it into the sink as opposed to an above mount sink where you've got that hard edge where the sink, uh, you know, if you're wiping something in, it's going to hit the edge of that sink. So the Grand Design, they're going the extra step, pull down faucet. It's the same faucet you get in an, in an Imagine as well. So, but again, look at all the storage solid wood cabinet doors your cabinet framing is all lumber core in here screwed together not stapled uh, so just a far superior design and build a lot of people like this layout because you have a common living area your your dinette is directly across from your couch the other benefit to this layout folks is that this couch is a trifold couch there's storage underneath of it and it trifolds out into a large double bed that you could sleep two adults there uh, if you would like so Real nice setup, Coleman mock air conditioning ducted. That's a 13,500 BTU ducted roof air conditioner. That ducted AC is ported right into the bathroom and into the front bedroom, which is nice. They don't give you the television on this, trying to save you some bucks for people that don't necessarily want a television, but they do give you the spot to put it uh, very easily. And they give you the uh, Jensen DVD uh, stereo CD player has Bluetooth capability very very good quality stereo designed for mobile use again they give you the pull down shades here reach up behind they darken out the trailer really really nice so got the vinyl leather like um, uh, finishing on your uh, sofa and your dinette cushions you can see they give you the nice blue lights for at night that you turn those on it just helps if the children need to get out of bed in the middle of the night and use the toilet it just helps lighten up the uh, interior of the trailer without making it too bright but you do have the two double large uh, double stack beds the way they've designed this is that they've kind of turned the dinette into a bit of a ladder and strengthened it up and made it nice and tough they got a spot here where you can slide a doggy bed out of the way some totes uh, what have you, USB connections, each of the bunks gets its own light, all of those things. And uh, you get to the bathroom, again, Grand Design, nice bright bathroom. I'll uh, give you a tip when you're doing your RV shopping, folks. Look to see how you and where you turn on the lights in the trailers. A lot of manufacturers, they give you the lights to save money. They won't put light switches inside the trailer. They'll only use the switch on the light itself. So in a lot of cases, you'll get like a button here, okay? We've had a product just recently where the family came in and the little guy goes in the bathroom and in order to turn on the light, he had to stand on the toilet to reach up to turn on the light. 
and there are a lot of well-known brands in the marketplace folks i'm not going to name names that do this they mount a mirror to the wall for your vanity they don't give you storage uh, they don't give you skylights they won't give you uh, abs tub surrounds and this is where grand design especially in a bathroom folks really be aware of what you're getting it's not always about price for some manufacturers it is it's not for grand design it's about value they even give you the extra little hooks there on the wall to hang some house coats or towels uh, nice big showers skylight like i said the famous towel rack where you can roll up your towels and stack them in here uh, you know right here in the corner you've got your vanity decent sized sink you know storage underneath and then you get the solid corner vanity here as well folks so it's not just again a mirror screwed to the wall and then the other thing you'll notice is the bathroom door it's actually got a full frame okay it doesn't have a great big gap above or a great big gap below right why one grand design ports ac into their bathroom and heat as well that's where some manufacturers one to save money they'll cut this wall up all the way up to the roof so you got a great big gap here at the top why because sometimes they don't heat their bathrooms or you don't get ac into their bathrooms so this is where grand designs go in the extra step again so we'll just shoot back around here again 62 gallon fresh water capacity folks your gray capacity on this trailer is double what a lot of the competitors are it's 68 gallon gray capacity and then your black tank your toilet tank is 39 gallons so fantastic capacities with this as well as that 30,000 btu furnace uh, again can uh convenience center this is where you get your tank monitors you turn on your um, gas electric hot water heater ceiling lights slide switches awning switches solid pocket door for your master bedroom which is really really nice you know fully closed off it's not curtains or anything like that oh, shooting back here got a few hooks here at the entry door for jackets that sort of thing motion sensor lighting right here at your front entryway as well so if you're coming in at night that light will automatically turn on but just to shoot around on the bedroom here you got the hanging storage on either side of the bed storage above and again residential size beds in all of their products so 60 wide by 80 long your regular fitted sheet will go around the mattress folks you've got that nice vinyl padded headboard as well just some really nice interior styling those types of things storage underneath the bed as well usb connections so Again, my name's Clayton Phillips. I'm the sales manager at our dealership here in Woody's RV World, Leduc, Alberta. We're just 15 minutes south of, of uh, Edmonton here, and we carry the Grand Design product, all of their brands, try to stock all their floor plans all the time. So we would love to host you at our dealership. For all of our faithful YouTube watchers and commenters, I thank you personally for, for the support you've given, the positive comments and uh, watching our videos it means a lot and to our our customers as well who have chosen to do business with us and let us go the extra mile i encourage you uh, check out the reviews of not just the rv uh, manufacturers and the way products are built but the dealers as well that you're going to visit uh, we're not all the same and and here at this dealership here in leduc we've done a lot of things to make this place special and really enhance your rv shopping experience we want to come alongside you and just make it as special as we possibly can so again we're just going to shoot back here on the 261 bh transcend explore the 2020 this isn't a 2019 this is as fresh as it gets from grand design their entry into the travel trailer segment we've got a bunch more floor plans we're going to start shooting a whole bunch more videos on the 2020s as they're starting to arrive grand design's got a whole bunch of special things up their sleeves coming and i uh, would love to host you to our dealership here in leduc our phone number is 780-986-1234 and uh, our address 8012 sparrow crescent leduc alberta canada Again, thank you for your time. Appreciate you. And uh, talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye.